Hey everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 6 Rise and Fall. So, let's press on, shall we? We got the Mongols to take care of. And then Robert the Bruce, who should be somewhere down here. And then also the Netherlands, but that won't really be a problem. Anyway, not much else we can do on this turn, I don't think so. We need to take care of this encampment district. And then we can move through. So that's the plan. And also Poundmaker. He's been bothering us to the north. But at this point he's nothing more than a pest. <laughs> he's not even doing a whole lot. He just moved in with a few units and that's about it. What's going on? Enemy stole tech boost. That's not very nice. You miss, you may Speaking stop. of tech, we got advanced ballistics. And next up we can get guidance systems, which will unlock the rocket artillery. That will definitely come in handy. Anyway, this encampment then. What's our range here? Yeah, we need to move closer than this. Alright. Let's move closer then. We just need to move around this stupid mountain. Alright. I guess that's what we'll do. Works for me. Oh, and we can pillage this trade route. Because it's not like we have anything better to do on this turn. And maybe repair the walls, that would be nice. And get rid of that artillery. Oh hey, we even got a promotion out of that. Nice. So, anything else? Not really. This is a bit of a choke point. One more trade route to pillage. Might as well. And that's about it. Any units in this area? Yeah, the infantry. We can use that. Anything else? Moving to the city. Rebellion in 30 turns. We could move a governor here. I suppose that wouldn't hurt. Where do we not need a governor? What are they doing right now anyway? Where's Liang? Oh, Amani is not assigned. Right, we can assign Amani, that's fine. Off you go then. And field cannon. Right, first we got a promotion. As for the privateer, I wouldn't mind upgrading him, but we can't really do it anywhere around here. He'll have to manage. One thing we could do is get a harbor and a shipyard in Olondi. And get a battleship or something like that. Mostly to use against the Scots. What's Olondi doing? Plus one error score. Oh yeah, power plant, right. It's about to finish too. That will certainly help. So, one more promotion. First, let's get rid of these guys. We almost lost our AT crew. I think he's slightly screwed, actually. Hold on though. We still got the infantry army. This is not quite enough for a kill. That's a little bit unfortunate. But this is enough for a kill. Yeah, we can move into our city. So he's safe. Doesn't really matter which one we'll move into. And we can pick up a promotion to heal him up. Yeah, this should be fine. 
Anyway, production. A little bit too late for an aerodrome. Let's just get to that amphitheater. And we finally got a submarine. That took long enough. It will still be useful. Workshop. And what else? Maybe some more units. A Colosseum is still available, really. That's funny. We could totally build that, yeah. Why the heck not? Power plant, aquarium. Let's replace the traders we lost. That's always some extra production. Won't say no to that. Any more units? Right, over here, near the Mongols. Let's see what we can do. What's the range? Need to be closer. That's good enough. Instant kill. And I'd like to start hitting that encampment as soon as possible. Here, we can start doing it on the next turn. Move out of that city bombardment range. Yeah, we can move through with the other tank. And promote. 97 range strength, not bad. Okay, so we have two helicopter armies and artillery army. They might be able to kill our infantry. And we still have to wait a few turns. Yep. Okay, fine. Yeah, let's send our own AT crew army. I have a feeling we're going to need it. So off you go. And it's not like we need him for anything else. Not really. Yep, they did kill one unit. The field cannon. That's fine. The plan right now is to take the Mongolian capital as fast as possible and then declare war on Scotland. I assume we are close. I hope we are close. But I guess we'll find out soon enough. First we need to get rid of this. Oh yeah, a promotion. That's very convenient. Right about now. Can we reveal the city? There it is. That's not the actual capital, however. Unfortunately. I don't think we need more than one artillery. We probably do not. You need to heal up. So where's the actual capital? It has to be somewhere close. There it is. Okay, we know where the capital is. Now to actually take it. Once we can move through this encampment, it shouldn't be too hard. Let's stay out of city bombardment range for now. And Olondi. So how about that harbor? It's not a bad idea. Shouldn't take too long. Yeah, three turns. Alright, let's grab that harbor then. And we can get a battleship or something like that. It will help against Scotland. Now, Poundmaker. He is getting on my nerves. Helicopter army is quite tough. I don't like that. Well, at least we got the artillery. Maybe move into the city. Okay, looks good. We should be fine. Kill that cavalry before it gets a chance to pillage something. 
and we can explore a little bit with the submarine. Oh, we actually found a tribal village, alright. Well, shame I can't do a coastal raid right now. Shouldn't be able to do it on the next turn. We might still get something useful out of that, like a boost. Oh, seriously? They have a battleship in here. Okay, then. It still shouldn't be a big problem, but we might need that other artillery after all. What's the range? Yeah, let's move a little bit closer. First of all, one more shot at the encampment. Then we can move in. Like so. Move our artillery. Okay, and pick up the promotion. As for the tank... Let's pillage this crap and then back up. Let the field cannons come to us instead. Yep, looks fine. House production. 9 out of 9 housing, right, neighborhood then. Can we get a decent one? Yes, we can. Next. Industrial zone. We don't need entertainment complex. Well, actually, minus one amenities. I suppose I wouldn't mind one. Or we can get some fighters or bombers. 14 turns for a bomber. That's a little bit too long. Let's just go for a trader for now. Yeah, let's replace our traders because we lost quite a few. What do you think you're doing? Yeah, that's the city-state again. It flipped. Keep a garrison for loyalty. As for the trader... Where is he needed the most? Our income is still fine. What's the best trader out here? Probably with the Netherlands. Plus 32 gold. Yeah, let's just go for that one. It's too good to ignore. Plunder the trade route. And you guys can stay in here and heal up. Nice catapult, bro. What are you planning to do with it? <laughs> How's our era score anyway? 152, and we need how much? 188, but we still have a lot of time. Oh, he will even pay us for peace, okay. Will he give us a luxury? Yes, he will. That's pretty funny. He will give us all of them. Yeah, sure, I'll take that. Maybe gold too. Not that much, apparently. Okay, not that much. Fair enough. 1000? No. 500? Yeah, that's a good deal. Accept. That will certainly improve our amenities. Now, the Mongols. Let's take care of this. And then we'll go for Scotland. More gold. We stole... 216 gold, yeah, okay. Completed military emergency. The target receives 2400 gold per member. And there were no participants, apparently. Well, we did receive the gold, right? I wasn't looking how much gold we had before this, but we did get some gold. And plus 4 era score. Hey, that's nice for the era score, if nothing else. So, let's see. This might be a little bit tricky. We could just focus on attacking the capital. Although, it might be a good idea to get rid of that battleship. Yeah, I think we should get rid of the battleship. Hold on, though. Let's do it like this. Can 
Can we kill it on this turn? Oh, it's down already. Okay. I'm going to ignore the frigate. Just start attacking the capital. I think we can actually just take it on the next turn. I'm pretty sure we can. Well, only one way to find out. What's next? Power plant? How about we get some units? What can we get in here? Some tanks? Or a trader that works too. And that's a lot of notifications. What do you think you're doing? Goodbye. Amsterdam is fine. Are we there yet? Yeah, another trade route. These are kind of bad. Plus 19 gold is fine, I'll take that. I like how the city is losing loyalty. <laughs> rebellion in 7 turns. Let's help the rebellion a little bit, shall we? Although, that will take 8 turns. A little bit too long. Let's move to some other city, but first pick up a promotion. Disrupt rocketry. Recruit partisans. Okay, sure, why not? Not much to see here. So, other notifications, just get rid of them. These are all events we've already seen. He is still trying, but his capital is about to fall. Can we do it now? Yes, we can, easily. And I think we'll just peace out immediately. There's no need to stay at war with him. But maybe kill another unit or two before we do so. Actually, nah, there's no need. Let's just peace out. What is he going to give us? Obviously the city we just took. Oh, he would give us another city, if we really want one. Okay. I don't think we care. No, we don't. I will take the great works, however. And maybe gold. As well as luxuries. We already have pearls. And thirds. Actually, we have whales, too. Give me the gold, then. There we go. Oh wait, he won't give us this much. 100 per turn? 200? Okay, 150. No? Fine, 100 gold per turn will do. Accept. So now, the next target is Scotland. We just need to actually get there, you know. Which means we need to get that silly city-state back. So that will involve sending our diplomat after all. Or getting one more envoy. Or we can do both. That works too. Just do both. Off you go. Alright, let's start moving already. We could just recruit fresh units and attack Scotland with that. I might do both. Aerodrome, 8 turns. That's a little bit too long. Especially since we'll need more than just an aerodrome to be able to airlift from this city. Not worth waiting for that, not really. So, Olondi. Oh yeah, we still need one more government plaza building. Not sure if I'm actually going to bother with that. Four slots for any great work. Yeah, I might just get that one. 
All units when they eliminate a unit heal up for 20. Yeah, okay, that one is nice. Let's get that one. Good enough. Wait, what? Oh, right, we are at war with Scotland. And he's sending some tanks. Okay. Fine, we have more than enough units in the area. Just send them over. Come on, no slacking. There's work to do. It's a shame we can't get that alliance with the Netherlands anymore. Because that way we would have open borders with them. But without an alliance, there's no way I can get open borders with them. That's not going to happen. We'll manage without it. Just send everyone in this general direction. As for the spy... Well, we don't need him in here anymore. Let's move to a different city, shall we? These are all kind of small. But alright. We can move over there. Still city bombardment. Oh yeah, that's a free city right now. Not going to bother attacking that. It might just flip to us anyway. He is trying. I love watching my mom argue with the Oh nice, we unlocked rocket artillery. In the that will definitely help. And some era score. Time to move into the city. Okay, let's be careful. We can't quite do anything about that tank on this turn. Actually, hold on. I think we can kill it. There we go, we got it. Definitely can't kill the other one though. <laughs> Not on this turn. As for our next research, we could grab combined arms. We could grab computers for the drone. Actually, yeah, let's maybe get... Which one was it? Combined arms. Because that's needed for nuclear fission and it will reveal uranium. We might still get a chance to nuke someone. We can always nuke the Netherlands. Ready before we end the game. I don't think we'll build a nuke fast enough to nuke Scotland. But I suppose we'll find out. Actually, a rapid deployment, because that way we'll be able to airlift between cities that have airports. We still got one more great person. A great general. Yeah, sure. Why not? I'll take that. Production. Food market is fine. That's not quite what I wanted to do, but okay. Now we need to wait to get the city-state back. Shouldn't take too long. Uh, do we need a garrison in here? No, we do not. It's fine without one. This is going to be more or less our last real war. <laughs> if you can even call that a real war. It's the last capital city we need other than the Dutch capital. But the Dutch capital is quite literally right next to us. That part will be easy. We don't even know where exactly the Scottish capital is, but I assume in this area. What do you want? He will actually sell us a luxury. One we don't have. 
Oh, he's asking for, like, everything we have. How about now? Anything we can do with our fate? Any useful great person in here? Jeans. Okay, that's useful, but we need a little bit of extra faith for that one. Great musician, sure, if we actually have slots for that. We might have one. Heal that tank. Goodbye. So, Rostavi, aerodrome, six turns. You know what, sure, let's get an aerodrome. Seaport 9, power plant 9. How's our governor? Still moving. Sixteen now. Seriously? I hope we'll be able to actually go through here at all. <laughs> I guess we can always wait for more envoys. Which policy will give us more envoys? Well, this one. What would be the easiest? That is actually the easiest. <laughs> okay. I suppose we can work on it once we finish rapid deployment. But that's 15 turns total. It might be easier to just recruit a brand new army, to be honest. I might end up doing exactly that. Oh, great. We can't even go through here. No, we can, but it's a bit of a choke point. This will take a while. Yeah, I think it will be easier to just recruit new units in Olondi and that general area. Or we could try to get a quick aerodrome with an airport in Karakorum. But I don't think there's going to be anything quick about it. Does it already have an aerodrome? Oh, we just can't get another district yet. 22 population. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Never mind. Yeah, that's not going to work. We'll come up with something, don't worry. I mean, this game is basically in the bug. Finishing it is mostly a formality. And can we actually use that great musician? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, never mind then. I thought we'll have a slot somewhere. But apparently that's not the case. Not that it really matters. It does not. Move elsewhere. I can't even sleep him. Oh, that's because there's a worker inside. Now we can sleep him. Is anything pillaged around here? Not that I can tell. The district is pillaged, but that has to be repaired in the actual city. We'll stay here on counter-espionage. Alright, sounds good. We are only at war with Scotland now. What do you want? I'm not really interested. Georgia thinks we're a warmonger. Hey, they attacked us first. We were just defending ourselves. 
While the Colosseum oh, hey, we got the Colosseum. <laughs> Rome shall stand. When the Colosseum falls, Rome shall fall. At least this general area won't have any amenity problems, that's for sure. Industrial zone. Yeah, that's a decent one down here. Factory, 14 turns. Sower is fine. And another sower. We still can't move through. Two more turns until our governor is established. That should make us the suzerain, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure it will. And then we can move through. Hopefully. Wouldn't surprise me if someone sent more envoys right away. Because that's been happening recently. Another trade route. Yep, Amsterdam is fine. Or actually, let's not send everything to Amsterdam. We can go for other cities too. Even though these trade routes are worse. Not much to see here. Oh hi, we found a natural wonder. A super useful discovery. Not. How far ahead are we? Probably quite far. We got 54 techs. Scotland has 50. Poundmaker has 46. But look at his science output, 168. We got 415. He's just a little bit behind. Another great person, great writer. I think we have the slots for that. Pretty sure we do, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.